Hey, this is Joseph Lebrec, and I'm going to be going over today some of the kind of polish around Adobe Edge Animate 1.0. So Animate is now an actual release product from Adobe. And you can see this is the final branding for it here. So its letters are A-N, and um, this sort of, um, you know, these stripes here so kind of set it aside from the normal Creative Suite branding, which is, of course, you know, something like like this with the box and, and so forth. So that's because uh, Edge is sort of its own family of products now. So having a look at Edge Animate, if we open it up, we can see it loads up very quickly. And we have that branding cascade across the application. And a lot of this stuff is the same as it's always been for the past few versions, right? So you've got the welcome screen here with features, resources, the quiet, and so forth. If I want to, I can go in and open up one of these files. So I've got this uh, older animated piece that I have here. Let's turn the pin off. and. All of this stuff is basically the same, except there's there's been a lot of polish, bug fixing, and so forth um, from the last version that we had, the last preview, which is preview seven. And along with the the changing of the branding here, we also have the changing of some file names. So if I open up an edge project here, you can see that no longer are they called dot edge projects? They're now dot an projects for animate. So animate projects. And the same thing if we go in and um, go into our symbol here. Let's create a symbol. I'll just quickly grab something, throw it on the stage, and turn that into a symbol so that I can export it. So now when I export this symbol, I can export it as an animated symbol, an animate symbol, so an sim. This used to be edge lib, if you remember. So those are the major changes in this last version, aside from obvious branding changes and the lessons and things like that. Um, everything else is just about the same as it's been in Preview 7. Uh, I guess the one sort of last thing to note about this version of Adobe Edge uh, Animate 1.0 is that 1.0 is actually going to be made available for free. So Adobe is making 1.0 available for anybody to download and use uh, for the life of the product. So this could change when they release 2.0. They're probably going to start charging for it, but this is going to give people, you know, a pretty good a uh, span of time to actually use this tool for really no cost to them whatsoever. And they'd be able to grab that uh, through the Creative Cloud. So you just go to creative.adobe.com and from here you're actually able to sign up for a free account of Creative Cloud which gives you some basics like um, integration with touch apps and things like that but it's also going to give you access to a set of these various edge tools uh, in particular uh, Edge Animate 1.0 that you can download and use as much as you want.